Hi class, welcome. I hope we're having a lot of fun learning about simple machines and how they make our lives easier. For today's project, we will be working on another simple machine. This type of simple machine is called a scale. So we will be doing a simple scale. Now a scale is also another type of a lever. So very easy to do. You will need very few items. The first item you will need is a hanger. I'm using a hanger with the notches on the top. If you don't have one with notches on the top, that is completely fine. Any hanger will do. This just makes it a little bit easier for me to hang the string off so I could show you. The other item you will need is a two cups. So I'm using two plastic solo cups. Make sure that the cups you are using, you don't mind ruining them because you will be punching out some holes for this project. Third item, you will need some string. You won't need a lot of string. I'm using about four feet, so about two feet per cup. And another item you will need are some scissors. Be sure to have an adult near you when you are using scissors. And last but not least, we also need, I have a hole puncher, but not everyone has a hole puncher and that's okay. So I'm asking just for something that will help you punch out some holes. So something that is sharp enough to punch out some holes in this. So not that many items, let's jump right into it. Okay, now that we have our items, we are ready to begin with your plastic cup. You'll notice I painted it yellow. That's only so you could see it better since it is since I have clear cups. Um, grab your cup and if you have a hole puncher, grab your hole puncher and make two holes on each side right across from each other. So you're gonna wanna do the same thing to both of your cups. Then you're gonna wanna grab your string and I'm cutting out two pieces of string the same length so that they are even. Then, once you're finished with that, grab your string and your cup and just lace it in and out the other end. And then just tie it at the very top. Have an adult help you with tying. Just a very simple knot, nothing fancy. Then grab your hanger. You're gonna place it somewhere. I'm placing it on top of my light fixture. You won't have to do that. Um, for your height, you'll probably just use a doorknob. And then just place it on the notches. If your hanger doesn't have the notches, you'll just have to place, tie it around your hanger but since mine does have the notch, I'm just placing it right there so that they're nice and even. You'll notice that they're the same height. That is your simple scale. It's super easy to do, but normally you will use a scale like this to weigh different items. So I do have different items that I want to weigh in front of you guys. So first item, I have a couple of numbers. And you can see they're all different numbers. So they're different shapes and you could test out and see which one's higher, which one weighs more. And it doesn't have to just be one type of item. You could grab different items. I also have some crayons. So place them in and you'll notice how the item with the cup with more items, it's coming down low, and the cup with fewer items, it is higher. So have fun experimenting. Maybe different items weigh different things, right? So you can just keep placing them and just see how many will take you to get them about back to the same height. So have fun with this. Can't wait to see you guys back in class so you guys can let me know um, what kind of items you used for your cups and that's it. So we'll see you guys back in class.